A deadly hit and run involving a cyclist. Tonight, the search for the driver and what Philadelphia officials are promising to do to make the city's roads safer. This is Eyewitness News at 6. We are streaming live on CBSN Philly. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jessica Cartalia. And I'm Natasha Brown. Yuki is off today. The bicyclist was killed crossing a road regarded as one of the most dangerous in the country. Police rushed to the scene near the boulevard and Adams Avenue in Somerdale. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo is at the scene with more. Matt. Justin Natasha, a witness told police the victim was crossing busy Roosevelt Boulevard behind me when a driver struck and killed him. The driver then took off. Philadelphia police are searching for a driver in a white and blue Ford F-150 truck. That officer say struck and killed a bike rider here on Roosevelt Boulevard by Adams Avenue around 7.30 Tuesday night. The driver then took off. Very dangerous. This man selling trash bags on Roosevelt Boulevard says he often sees drivers whizzing by way too fast here. It ain't worth it. It ain't worth rushing. A ticket. Hurt somebody, it ain't worth it. The deadly hit and run crash happened just hours before Philadelphia officials <laughs> held a ribbon cutting event Wednesday to unveil safety improvements along North Broad Street. Officials also released the city's annual Vision Zero report. It aims to get traffic deaths in Philly down to zero by 2030. We continue to be committed to eradicating traffic fatalities. Last night's victim is the seventh bicyclist to be killed in Philly so far this year. That's more than any year since 2016. Why are more cyclists dying in the city? Because people are being irresponsible the way they're driving their cars. The mayor isn't wrong. Eyewitness News captured driver after driver blowing right through the red light at the same intersection where that bike rider was killed. Um, all traffic deaths are avoidable. We need to see way more protective bike lanes. We need to see way more uh, pedestrian improvements like we have here. Yeah, the Bicycle Coalition of Greater Philadelphia there. Now, the city says it is working to build more protected bike lanes. Its goal is to have 40 miles of protected bike lanes in the city by 2025. Reporting live, I'm Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Matt, thank you so much.